everybody doing today i hope all right so for those that are new to the channel hello my name is my shalina and thanks for joining if you're not already subscribed then go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you'll be able to find me again so you won't get lost in the youtube world um so today as you already know i'm going to be showing you a dollar tree haul but first before i get into the dollar tree haul of the new stuff that i just got i want to show you some stuff that i bought a couple of years ago from dollar tree i may have already did a haul but i'm not 110 percent sure but i want to show you anyway so if you've already seen this then i'm sorry but there are a lot of new people that are here on this um channel so i'm gonna show you this bag it was in my store bought this stuff I don't know when but obviously sometime around springtime a couple of years ago and my intentions was to make me a spring wreath and I never got around to it because I never could find um, the form for it you know some Dollar Trees they have them all the time sometimes they don't but anyways I got this cute little pink little rabbit from the Dollar Tree he is so cute or she whatever and then I had got these uh, egg picks and I, now I'm thinking about it. I think I did do a video of this, but this is just a reminder, I guess, because this is the stuff that I'm going to be using to make a wreath today. So if you guys want to see that, I'm going to record it. If you want me to upload it, then just let me know in the comment section down below and I'll do that. But um, I got the pink um, deco mesh, decorative mesh is what they call it at Dollar Tree. I got this real pretty blue. And what is so weird or cool is that I picked these colors before unicorns were like really popular or popular at all. I got the pink, blue, and purple. And now like these are like unicorn colors, you know. <laughs> but so I got two purple, two pink, and two blue. And that should be plenty to make the wreath. So I can't wait to make my wreath and hang it up. I've already started kind of decorating for spring in the kitchen. And then I also have these um, pipe cleaners and these are pretty colors. So that's what I'm going to use to make my wreath. Now, let's just get into this Dollar Tree haul of the new stuff that I just got. So first, we're just going to start off with the stuff that's right in front of me. I picked up some more of these um, elastic, what are they? Uh, they're class free round elastics to holders there's 15 of them I get the I got I like to get the ones without the little gold metal claps claps I think that's how you say it thingy because um, those little thing metal thingies like snag your hair and you know Vivi's hair is super super curly so I got these for her and me but basically then I picked up some um, lip colors so I've already opened this one and it's in my bedroom somewhere or in my bathroom but this one is called dreamy and it's a real pretty like um nudie brown color so i picked up what one two three four five six one two three four six eight i picked up eight in total and my plan was to do a video we're trying them all on so you got you gotta let me know what you guys think about that because i also got the color plush i got the color posh i got the color Fantic. I got Heartthrob. I got Twilight. And I got Polish. And then I think the other color I got is called Skinny Dip. Because this was called Dreamy. I think the other one's called Skinny Dip or something like that. So I was going to do a video where I tried them all try them all on so if you guys want to see that video let me know it depends my lips right now are recovering from being broke out i had an allergic reaction to some chapstick that i tried out and yeah so anyways just let me know what you guys think about that um i also picked up this um root beer it says it's chicago style root beer wbc um it's made with real sugar so i've already drunk one of them and it's really good y'all know i love root beer it's one of my favorite drinks so sometimes i like to try out different ones just kind of see you know the difference amongst them so i picked up i think i picked up actually i picked up 
four. So I drunk one. One is in the cooler, and then here's two right here. I actually got two for a friend. Um, I'm gonna give to them so they can try it out too, cause they I think they like root beer. And then I got some more of this watermelon lemonade. I think I've already talked about this on my channel before. This is by Turkey Hill. This juice is so good. The watermelon lemonade is bomb. The regular lemonade by the same brand is bomb. I don't like the pomegranate, pomegranate lemonade one. I didn't like that one. The strawberry kiwi lemonade is really good, but this one is super, super good. I need some pink star burst. The strawberry, I think they're strawberry, yeah. Super good, but I have to slow down on these because you know, they're, they're, rough. they're a little hard on your teeth. And of course, I picked up some toilet paper. Like, every time I go on a Dollar Tree, I pick up a pack, whether I need it or not, so I can always have toilet paper in hand because when you got kids, you can never have too much toilet paper, okay? Snack bar says keep it healthy. Um, mango almond. So I don't know. I'm gonna try try this out and see if it tastes. You know what? Let's try it out now. It looks kind of funky. <laughs> I don't know if I like the way it looks. I don't even know. If, oh, <laughs> I don't know if I like the way it smells. It kind of smells like bread, but then it smells like I don't know. Ew. figure out what that smell is I guess it's like mango look look at it y'all it's real like squishy like it's not the texture that I thought I was gonna be you can see bits of almond in there I don't know if I like it or not mmm It's good, but it's not. I don't know. It tastes like... You know what? It tastes like... It reminds me of toast. But like... Or bread. Soft bread. With mango jam. With almonds sprinkled on top. If it's really healthy for you, I could eat it um, to be healthy, to not eat cookies. Because I guess it's like, it says it's gluten-free, non-GMO, vegan, it's dairy-free. So it's got all these like good things about it, right? It ain't bad, but it ain't like I would just like go and grab it. But... If it wasn't my purse and I was hungry, and I or I'm about to go get, get on a plane and I just kind of want a little snack, I guess I could eat it if I'm in a healthy like I'm in a healthy mindset. Anyway, also pick me up a scarf. This one is like a real pretty pinkish color with roses all over it. I absolutely love it. It's so pretty. This would be really cute with the plain like white tank top. You know, wear a tank top and just wear the scarf over it, or you could wear it as a head wrap different stuff you can do with it I think I showed y'all this you know I'm not sure it was still in um, my bag of stuff to show but I don't know if I showed y'all this but in case I didn't I got this from Dollar Tree too it's a citrus juicer like you use to make you know get um, to juice a lime or a lemon and I got this because I'm gonna be back drinking my apple cider vinegar with lemon tea so I gotta get my body right because um somebody is going on a big vacation this summer and she wanna be looking good in her bathing suit. I'll tell you guys more about that later. I did buy me a brand new and I just realized it looks like it is cracked. It is right here. Let's see that it's bent, it's cracked. But anyway, I can still use it. But I bought me a new wreath form or metal wreath 
metal wreath ring is what it's, the proper term is. So I got me this so I can make my wreath for the spring. I just don't know if I'm gonna hang it on my door outside or if I'm gonna put it in my kitchen because when it's on the door outside, like everybody else gets to enjoy it, I don't get to see it unless I'm coming home or leaving. And I think I wanna see it more often. So I'm thinking about putting it in my kitchen. Y'all, I seen this and I had to have it. Isn't it so cute? Like, when I seen it, I thought about my children because I have four kids, so that's why I got it. And I actually only have one girl, so it's one pink bunny. And so, in my mind, I could say this is Braylon, Vivica, Kingston, and Donovan. <laughs> I don't know, but I just thought it was cute. And it's that little faux uh, wood look, and it says, welcome. And I don't know, I might put this on the door. I don't know, I forgot I had this, so... We'll see, but I just thought it was cute for only a dollar. And I tell you, the Dollar Tree little wooden signs like this, the faux wooden signs are getting better and better each season, I tell you. So, okay, so I don't know if y'all can tell the quality in this video might be a little different. You gotta let me know which one you like better. I don't know. My camera died on me, so it's sitting next to me charging. So I just came over here on my MacBook so I could finish, wrap up this video. Um... <clears throat> So I only had a few more things to show you. So let's just let me just show you. Um, I bought me a new beauty blender. Where's the back of this at? It's called a blender sponge by Sassy and Chic. It looks like this. So it comes in the package like this. And I got me a pink one. But I already used it and I like it. I've had one before from Dollar Tree, but it was a couple of years ago, and I believe I had a blue one. And if I'm able to find that video y'all look at my look at my hair did i like i kind of blended that in good like did i did i did i or did i not you could barely see it but anyways anyway um i bought one a couple of years ago i believe it was blue but now they're like they've gotten better to me in my opinion um but like i'm not no makeup guru i don't wear makeup all the time so i don't know but i like it i mean for a dollar why not so I got that and I did my makeup this morning live here on the channel so you be sure to check that video out I put a link to it if you want to see it I also picked up this right here by Salon Sel Salon Selectives um it's a shampoo now is it something that I highly recommend that's really good for your hair no because it has sulfate in it I believe right it's not sulfate free Yes, it has some it has some type of sulfate in it. So you know, it says it's low sulfate. It has it in there, but it's low, it's not a lot. Um, it says it's enriched with um vitamin E, blase, blase, blase. Okay, the reason why I bought it is because I desperately needed some shampoo and I did not want to go to the beauty supply store because I didn't want to get enticed to buy a new wig. I didn't want to go in Walmart and walk all the way over to the hair department. I was in Dollar Tree, so I was just like, let me just pick up some shampoo because I really needed some shampoo. My hair was super, 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 super dirty from putting gel in it and whatnot. For a dollar, I think it's great. It smells good. I used it on Vivica's hair. I used it on my own and it got my hair nice and clean and it smells amazing. I love a good smelling shampoo. The pump. I love a product that has a pump on it. It makes it so much easier to use. So I got that. I also picked up some Daily, by, this is by Daily Defense, and it also has a pump. So shout out to Dollar Tree for putting some pumps on the product. Well, I don't even think this is a Dollar Tree brand. Low, wait, 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 reverse. No. But shout out to the companies that's putting, yeah, 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 that's putting uh, pumps on their products. Now, this says it's um, a body wash, and it's fresh a rose. And it does smell rosy. So... I don't know how I'm going to like it because I love roses, but I'm not a big fan of the rose smell depending on, because you know there's a, different types of rose smells, but it has a very strong rose smell in the jar. Now, how is it going to smell when I put it on my body? I don't know. So that's what I'm waiting to see. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm sorry if I got a little talkative. It's been a while since I did the Dollar Tree haul, so I was super excited. Um, again, if you want to see how I got this look, my makeup look, be sure to check out that video. It will be in the description box below. And um, if you're not subscribed to the channel, what are you waiting for? Subscribe. And like always, until next time, stay you, stay beautiful, and stay unique. Bye, guys.